What's up guys, I want to talk to you guys a little bit about some Call of Duty and uh, Halo and other games, mostly Call of Duty because that's the game I play. I don't have an Xbox. And uh, the Daily News is article for the last two days about uh, trying to blame video games for mass murders that have been going on. But um, it just really upset me the last couple days, you know, picking up the newspaper and seeing these articles saying, you know, that, that really it's about the video games and the gamers mentality. What you, what you want? What you, what you want? The Daily News pointing fingers at you guys right there. They've been throwing up some red flags lately. I'm a, I'm an avid reader of the Daily News, or I was. Um, but a couple of red flags that I'd like to point out to you guys that I wasn't really too thrilled about is that uh, first, uh, I think it was last year with uh, Chris Stevens, the U.S. ambassador in Libya, you guys putting that photo on the paper. I thought that was totally uncalled for. I, I didn't think that you should put uh, an unconscious man on the brink of death in a picture on the newspaper that really upset me and then there was another article about giving your dog kisses or getting kisses from your dog and that's gonna give you gum disease that was another one that pissed me off but now this one this one takes the cake so after this I don't think I'm no longer gonna be a, a reader for the daily news and even after those other articles of getting them I, I don't even read these no more because it's like Lindsay Lohan and it's like TMZ if I want a TMZ I go to TMZ and I do go to TMZ and then wait if I go read it in the paper it's TMZ all over again that's your source oh my gosh anyways we cannot be blaming video games that's the pretty much the gist of this video and you're gonna say why why can't we blame video games because wait were there wars around before video games yes there were. Are you saying that because Hitler, Mussolini, all these leaders who killed people, all these wars that started, are they because of video games? No. If you take video games away, there is still going to be violence. There are going to still be people who are going to go out and do things. And, and whose fault is it? Is it the movies? Is it the video games? No. Don't point the blame at anyone. If you could point the blame at anyone, and I'm not pointing blame, maybe it's the newspapers. Maybe it's the newscasters. Maybe it's you guys that are portraying these these killers and putting them out there on the front covers and these people are seeing it and it's like you're giving them so much attention they're glorified killers and maybe maybe you guys are to blame I'm not saying you are but I'm just saying like let's just get with the facts like that could totally be it maybe they're seeing it in the newspaper you're bringing awareness to it and now they're like hey I want to do that hey I want my recognition I mean come on like th what's gonna be news these days I'm mad. I'm, I'm seriously so mad. I'm mad that they would blame gamers. I'm mad that they would blame the game developers, Black Ops, Halo, whatever. I mean, you got, you got all this stuff that's going on right now and you're just looking to blame somebody. Don't blame. Don't blame. If you want to blame, blame the person who did it. Okay? That's who you're going to blame, okay? Maybe blame the economy. Maybe if that kid had a good job and was out doing things, being productive, maybe then this wouldn't have happened. Maybe if he had a religious belief or something that was stronger that could just, you know, make him not want to go out and do that. Maybe that. Maybe you just want to blame all these different things but the real source. The blame is on the kid, okay? He did it. I'm not going to say his name because I'm not going to give him the glorification of saying his name, okay? It's not video games. That is all I'm saying, okay? I want to know what your thoughts are on this. I, pro I probably got a little carried away. I just wanted to make like a minute video talking about it. Now I'm just talking over four minutes, but whatever. I just want to say, from a person who played Call of Duty, it ain't the video games, kids. It's not the video games. First Amendment. It's like trying to point fingers and it's like why do we got to play this blame game what what's up with playing this blame game why why is it got to be the video games why is it got to be the movies why is it got to be the tv shows why 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 do we have to blame why can't we just point our fingers at the person who did it